Well, this is where the latest tragedy happened, at the junction of Bressenden Place and Victoria Street, near Victoria Station. This area is undergoing massive redevelopment and the roads get very busy with construction vehicles. And it was just before 8 o'clock this morning during the rush hour that a cyclist in her 30s is believed to have been in collision with a tipper truck as they were both turning left into Victoria Street. Now she's the second cyclist to have died at this junction. Two years ago, Catherine Giles was also killed here when she was in collision with a vehicle as well. Four cyclists have now died on London's roads this year alone. Safety campaigners are now calling for urgent action, including reducing the speed limit to 20 miles an hour on busy roads like this and safer lorries to be introduced as quickly as possible. We believe that these trucks are unfit for purpose. They're designed, they're designed as off-road vehicles and they work on construction sites and waste materials and there should be a safer design of lorries in London. We've proposed, we put a challenge to the construction industry to have safer lorries where the driver is brought down low, where the driver's line of sight is where the people, where the cyclists, where the pedestrians are. And what does TfL have to say, Yvonne? Well, Transport for London says making the roads safer for cyclists is a top priority for them. They say they're spending £1 billion on improving the existing cycle superhighways and improving junctions like this. And they're saying that cyclists should start to see improvements in the next few weeks and the next few months. That, of course, is of little comfort to another family in mourning tonight.